What's up, YouTube? How'd you like that? That was my, uh, that was the best Bash 041 impersonation I could do. Uh, if you don't know that guy, definitely go check him out. I add him in the links, Bash 041. I just started watching his videos. And uh, he'll go to like a random ass place, like just say McDonald's, walk in, and do that same thing except for like five times louder and five times longer. It's a fucking trip. But uh, yeah, if you hadn't checked him out, definitely go do so. It is finally some decent weather and I'm able to ride. So I've been taking advantage of it. Ah, oh, I feel so good. But anyway, I've been taking advantage of the nice weather. Well, say I've been, uh, I'm riding today. Uh, throw me back on night shift. Really puts a damper on my, uh, I guess my lifetime. All I do is freaking work anymore. I don't ever have time. Like, it's, what, like, 4 o'clock in the afternoon, I believe. And depending on what time I go to bed in the morning, it's hard to work all night long. Those of you who have worked sh uh, shift work know what I'm talking about. It's hard to work all night long, come home, shower, go to bed. Like, you have to have time to unwind and all this stuff. And, you know, you'll be up for two, three hours. You're like, damn it, now I'm sleeping until four, five, six o'clock in the afternoon. It's getting dark at six o'clock in the afternoon now, so, you know, you're done. That's it. Plus, it's been cold as balls, which balls aren't really all that cold. They're actually kind of warm and sweaty most of the time, but you know what I mean. It's cold as hell out here. Well, hell's not cold either, damn it. It's cold as Antarctica. Let's try that one. It was in the teens not too long ago. Uh, it's weird. It went from being 18, like, what, two weeks ago to 65, 68 right now. Pretty nice little, uh, little temperature swing we got going on here. But, uh, that's cool. I want one of those. The Extendomatic 500. Now, um, I am headed to the post office right now. Um, I should have a little something something coming in the mail from one of my subs. From the Mr. Magnum Dubstep over in Texas, yeah, I believe it's right, Texas. He um, he does vlogging, but instead of being on a motorcycle, he does it from his Dodge Magnum. Imagine that, Magnum dubstep, Dodge Magnum. What do you think? Um, but yeah, I sent him some stickers out, so he should be sending me some stuff out. He said he should be here today, so I'm about to go check it out. Um, I wasn't going to get a P.O. box, because I really don't, I mean, let's be honest, I have like 100 subs. I don't have enough of a fan base to be doing you know mail videos and you know stuff like that but I was sending out a lot of stickers and realized that on all the stickers there was my address for the return address or whatever so uh well yeah screw it I'll go up there I'll pay the 50 bucks give me a pill box for a few months check it out it'll be handy because I mean I'm not one of those people who are real secretive and I've got to hide you know don't find me this and that but Dude, there's a lot of people out there who steal shit. And, yeah, I don't really want to just be mailing out my address to everybody. So, I've got a P.O. box. Um, I'll put the number up on the screen right now. It's, uh, if I remember right, it's 4661. Eats in Georgia, blah, blah, blah. You know, all that good stuff. Etonton. That's how all the out of towners say it. Like, where are you from, Etonton? Oh, Etonton. I have no clue why I just went to a uh, Chinese girl accent right there. Oh, you're from Edenton. Anyway, I apologize that I haven't had a video out in a little while. I've uh, been, like I said, busy with the work, uh, busy with shitty weather. Um, I know I watched Do It With Dan. He's down in Brunswick. He's had the same problem. Uh, folks in Atlanta have the same problem. Just there for a solid two weeks. We got nothing but rain. And, uh, uh, okay. I might just cut off. Mm -hmm. 
That was really weird. All right. As you know, on my last video, I saw I had my chain chain. I went riding around Walmart, was it yesterday or the day before? I just did a quick ride. I was actually picking my bike up from my brother-in-law's house. It had been over there for a while. But, um, rode through the parking lot and I chinged at a couple of people in the parking lot going in and out. And they didn't seem very amused. They just kind of stared at me like, uh, you're an idiot. Damn buzzards. Oh no, school bus! We must stop. We must stop for the school bus for the little kids. The little boys and girls. I know that kid. <laughs> he had no clue who I was. He seen my bike a hundred times and still had no clue who I was. Anyway. I gotta itch my nose. <laughs> I need one of those long ass tongues where I can just reach up there and lick my nose and scratch it. How about that ladies? If I could reach my nose with my tongue, how would you like me then? How you like me now, bitches? This is the beautiful city of Etonton. We have courthouse. We have, uh, what else do we have? That's about it. But I mentioned earlier that I was watching a couple of new people. Um, I've really branched out lately trying to watch as many new and upcoming guys as I can because I like to watch people grow. It's not just the big hitters out there. One guy who's actually from Georgia, uh, y'all need to go check him out. Really cool guy. Um, he's actually, we've been talking a little bit before he got his camera and all that set up. But uh, his name is Faith Riding Johnny. Um, He's got a Grom. He just took it to, uh, he just took it to Blood Mountain. And I guess it's kind of a bad time because I need to run here and get my stuff. But I'll finish here in a minute. I'll be right back. So where was I at? Um, oh yeah. Faith Riding Johnny, my boy, um, really cool guy, he's got a Grom that he took to, um, to Blood Mountain, uh, I believe that's his last video, pretty sure it was, I think I just watched it last night, as a matter of fact, sitting at work, on my ass, watching YouTube, that's right, because that's how I roll, but, uh, Watched it. He's got a uh, another glove one. Um, I think Alpine Star Glove Review. Anyway, he's got a few videos out. He's getting started. So if you're watching this, uh, please go check him out. I uh, put him in a link. He has a uh, R6. Can't remember what year it is. It's a uh, it's a newer style, the 06 and up or whatever. Um, newer than mine, but. <clears throat> Uh, he's got it, but from what I understand, he tried to park it onto a guardrail, and you know how that worked out. It's just, you know, that kind of puts him down for a little while. But luckily, he's okay. Um, I can't remember if I've seen pictures of his bike or not. I want to say I have, but I can't really remember them. But, yeah, then for whatever reason, he apparently wanted to park it onto a guardrail, and now he's got a wee bit of work to do to it. A wee bit. Hello, Mr. Officer. That was embarrassing.
that's about all I got for this uh, vlog. I completely lost my train of thought after I left Ace Hardware, so I have no clue what I was talking about, uh, what I was going to talk about, anything like that. So that's going to be it. As always, thanks for watching. Uh, like, subscribe, email, share, whatever. Y'all know what to do. I uh, appreciate it. I'm out, y'all. Alright y'all, I know I said I was done, but um, I just opened up my package from Magnum Dubstep, and I got such a kick out of it, I had to add it back in here. Um, I sent him a sticker and a keychain, and he said he, he would uh, hook me up with some stuff, uh, if I did. So he sent me a mic, which HDE, I don't know my mics, but this is like, actually heavy, mine was nothing but just a little piece of wire and plastic but this one actually feels like it's you know like cheap stuff feels light uh this does not so hopefully i better get some use out of this thing right here which right now i'm using my uh center backpack but uh, for all my other recording stuff that i do off the bike i use a mic and it's a mono mic this and that uh i gotta look the details up on this but that should be super nice <laughs> and this is uh well i'll read the letter uh, stickers what I got a kick out of but look how legit that is like he's got his own why am I shooting your bird right now he's got his own logo uh, what is it called water printed anyway into the letter but I was up for in house life here's some stickers I hope you like them uh, I hope you can fit them on your windshield I uh, can fit them uh, if you're wondering what the third one is it's a uh, need for speed logo so I have a short letter currently working on a new logo design for my intro to my new videos, until next time, ride safe, Magnum Dubstep. But that is legit, dude. I need to get some paper watermark to print it or whatever like that. That's awesome. But, <laughs> these stickers trip me the hell out. Uh, first, you got Hoonigan. I mean, who doesn't like, like Hoonigan? And I don't have one. I've been wanting to get one. So that worked out perfect. Uh, the need for speed. I need to look this up. I don't know which way it goes. Yeah, well, they're probably laughing at me right now, but I don't know which way it goes. I'll figure that out. But <laughs> with the additional unveil, you know, I so said I gave it about five horsepower. You know, had it come with a sticker, it'd give it ten. Right? I got my other five horsepower. That <laughs> that fits perfectly with my little chingy team. <laughs> so, uh, man, double set. Thank you. Uh, this is awesome. Uh, these all three are going onto my bike. Um, I'd like to get some more stickers. I'm going to be clearing my windscreen soon. It's all dirtified. Yes, that's a word now. Dirtified. But uh, I'd like to go ahead and. Yeah, bird shit. I didn't realize what it was until I smeared it all over my finger. Get all of them put on here. And then I'm going to clear it. And I guess after that, then maybe. Maybe my tank. I don't know, but we'll figure it out. Yeah, if you need, want to send me anything, here it is. So, all right, I am really out this time. Uh, I've got a heap of crap to do before I have to go to work tonight. So, peace, y'all. I'm out. Have a good one.